Welcome to Diner Week. My name is Eamon Rocky. I'm the general manager at Betney. And I'm Bryce Schumann. I'm the executive chef at Betney Restaurant. And today we're going to be doing our take on some classic diner dishes. We've got a take on grilled cheese and tomato uh, with a little bit of chips. And uh, what goes better with that than root beer float? I decided to do a grilled cheese soup and a tomato sandwich. It's just this like toasted uh, ciabatta bread that we make here in house and then some of the tomatoes from Eckerton Hill. And they're just sliced and seasoned and marinated in a little olive oil and basil and spread with a little bit of tomato jam. Instead of just plain chips, we do some uh, like corn chips with a little bit of our own barbecue seasoning. So. And then we need to have the soup on the side. So basically take Parmesan rinds and caramelize them off, toast brioche and bread and brown butter and take the solids and then we steep it all in this uh, stock and make this tea that tastes just like a grilled cheese sandwich. You know we use about a agar, we do an agar clarification so it's about 2% and we freeze it and then we thaw it out and it filters through the cheesecloth and you get this really crystal clear uh, liquid that just tastes like a great grilled cheese. I like the Astro. It's over here on 55th. It's a stone's throw away and it's awesome. All right, so I chose Root Beer Float because, you know, I've been a, I've been a fan of diners for a really long time. Um, you know, Root Beer Floats, malts, things like that, are always things I look forward to uh, when I went to a diner as a kid. We sourced uh, sassafras locally and birch also, uh, cinnamon, all sorts of good things, molasses, brown sugar, and we could have made a soda out of that, but we actually took it one step further and allowed it to ferment, and then we bottle conditioned it here at, here at Betany. Drive home that, um, that classic vanilla root beer float sort of flavor. Um, the, uh, the leaf in the drink is actually root beer leaf as well, and you can eat it. It's delicious and does taste like root beer. The Kellogg Diner that's pretty close to my place in Brooklyn uh, that I've been to once or twice, but um, I'm, I'm still on a, on a quest to find the best. 